Hi everyone, it's Tristan, and in this episode, we'll talk about how to add the music bot that I've just added inside of Easy Commands library. So right now, your main class should look like that if you follow the two latest videos correctly. Your main class should look something a bit like that. But today, it's about to change because there's a bunch of little things that have been modified. Actually, like two or three things that have changed, and that's it. And now you're going to be able to have a music bot in a matter of minutes, like literally. So first things first, what you want to do is go to the link in the description where you're going to be able to see Lava Player. It's a GitHub repo. And right here, you're going to have those two repository, well, a repository block and a dependency block. First of all, let's grab the repositories one. Let's go inside the pom.xml inside your project and just paste it there. Then go back onto the website. Right here, you're going to have another dependency block. Well, actually, this is going to be a dependency tag. And you can just paste it right here inside of your pom.xml. Now for the version, it's going to be 1.13. Uh, no, it's 1.3.77. Yep, just like that. Press that little button right here to reload the Maven changes. And now you should be good to go for the pom.xml. You can close it off. So as you can see right now, it's created us an error with ease comments because I've updated the pom.xml. Just go inside your project structure. Right here, you're going to look at easy comments. Remove that. We don't need it anymore. Okay, so after closing off the pom.xml, now what you want to do is go inside the description and there's going to be another link. Now it's, it's going to be for my GitHub repo at easy comments and right here on the right hand corner you should see releases just click on that and if you scroll down right here you're gonna have the latest release you can see that's the 0.2 let's click on assets and you can click on easy jar boom it's gonna download it automatically that's pretty useful now inside your documents just replace the old one by the new one so just delete the old one rename this one boom that's the new one that's what we want to do then we're back to idea you can now Click plus Java, go back inside of your documents. Actually, so right here inside my documents, I've put easy commands. Well, remember that click on the jar, click OK, OK, apply, OK again. And now those problems right here. Oh, it didn't add the library. What? So after adding the library again, everything's good to go. As you can see, my imports went, uh, came back. OK, so now it's time for the modifications inside the main class. So what we want to do is the arrays dot as list right here there's gateway intents what you want to do is actually put ease comments dot gateway intents just like that right under here right under gda builder you want to gather the gda builder enable cache you want to say easy comments dot cache flags oh and i forgot you actually want to say arrays dot as list because there's a it's a list basically of cache flags all right so that's good then right here it's building off the bot and right on top of update comments right here right on top what you want to do is say easy comments dot enable music bot all right we should be good to go now let's hope so let's start a bot. Okay, so if you followed along, you shouldn't have any errors right here. Uh, it should have logged in successfully, the WebSocket, everything. Now the comments ain't showing up. So just restart it again. And now once you restart it, you should see L command, say command. Those are the two commands that we've registered over here. And you should see play command, stop, now playing, and skip. Great, that's exactly what you, what you want to have. All right, so now inside of Discord, oh, I can kick this one out. That was the testing bot. You can now say slash. And usually if you click on YouTube bot, now you should see all of those beautiful commands right here that you have. If you do slash inside of Discord now, you should see play. And then it's going to ask for a link, uh, a link or a name. You can put uh, one of both. I believe both will works will work. So let's put Drake Rich Flex, which is uh, one of his latest music uh, that he released. Let's try it out. As you can see, it works. Oh, oh, no, 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 buddy, buddy. <laughs> All right, we good, we good. So as you can see, it added the new music uh, and now it's, it's playing. Actually, the bot is playing music. You cannot just you can just hear it. That's totally normal. I don't want to get copyrighted on that video. You can now use now playing, for example, that's going to tell you the music that is playing. Oh, that's not the good bot. I was wondering for a second. Sorry, guys. It's uh, let's use a good bot. Yeah, as you can see, Drake 21 Savage Rich Flex. All right, uh, let's, for example, add another music. Let's add with the same bot. I need to be careful. Let's add, I don't know. Let's say Drake on BS. There we go. I don't have any other ideas. As you can see, it added on BS. And now let's say slash skip. And now we're going to play the next track. And if you want to stop it all, just say stop. And the player has been stopped and the queue has been cleared. So yeah, guys, that was it for this video. I hope you enjoyed it. And I, uh, yeah, we'll see you in the next one. Keep coding.